Hi everyone, I am Dr. Sangeeta Dubey, Consultant Gynecologist. It is preterm awareness month, so let us discuss what is preterm delivery or prematurity. Typically, a pregnancy lasts for 40 weeks. If uh, labor pain starts before 37 weeks, it is called preterm labor. If the birth of the baby before 37 weeks, it is called preterm birth. Preterm labor always does not always indicate the patient will give the birth of the baby uh, th before 37 weeks. By giving some medication, we can prevent preterm labor. India ranks number one in worldwide regarding preterm birth. Now we will discuss what are the risk factors of preterm birth. Exactly, there is a not any known risk factor for the development of the preterm birth. There are the, some uh, risk factors we can assume that is the most common is the if the patient having the previous history of preterm birth. This is the most common uh, reason and uh, after that there is a, if there is a shortening of the cervix or any injury to the cervix uh, during previous delivery or any cervical uh, operation has been done previously. These are the risk factors. In uh, most importantly, multifetal gestation that is the twin pregnancy or triplet pregnancy or any kind of infection like UTI or vector vaginosis or the patient having history of uh, addiction history that is the most commonly the smoking and uh, if the patient's age is less that is then less than 17 years or older that is more than 35 years. These are the most common risk factors for the development of the preterm birth. Now what are the symptoms of preterm birth most common symptoms is uh, abdominal pain and uh, rupture of the membrane that is the leakage of uh, water and uh, there may be the changes in the vaginal discharge like it may be the watery discharge or maybe the bloody discharge patient may having the feeling of the um, heaviness in the abdomen and backache is also the most common symptoms so why we are so much aware or discussing about the preterm birth? Basically, it is uh, the problem in the fetus. Patient, uh, fetus may develop, that means the baby develops some, uh, some long-term complication and sh some short-term complication. Uh, what are the short-term complications? Short-term complications are the patient having the uh, fetus having the low birth weight. And uh, most commonly that is uh, uh, breathing difficulties and uh, infection chances of infection and jaundice will be high and there will be the difficulty in the vision and in long term complication the patient having the uh, fetus having a cerebral palsy